Back to school season is kicking into gear, and efforts are growing across multiple states to help students focus by tackling cell phone use in classrooms. I had very difficult um, interactions with students who answered phones in the middle of class who didn't want to put them away. While California Governor Gavin Newsom signed a law back in 2019 allowing districts to regulate phones during academic hours, on Tuesday he took it a step further, sending letters to schools statewide urging them to restrict usage of the devices on campus. I think legislation banning the use of cell phones during the school day is fair. Um, I think there's very clear evidence that cell phones don't have a great positive effect on our mental health. Meanwhile, in South Carolina, the State Board of Education is crafting a proposal for its districts to ban phones during class time. A final vote is expected next month. We still allow a cell phone to be on campus. It just has to be turned off and put away. The reason we're not banning a cell phone is because we know that many students need to communicate with their families after school hours for rides. But while phones can be on their way out, another form of technology could be infiltrating more districts. Some experts say artificial intelligence can help students increase learning, especially kids with reading difficulties or those who need help taking notes. If you have a hidden disability and you don't want to be uh, open about the fact that you're suffering from dyslexia or something else, you can use an AI reading assistant to actually help you read. So you can actually record a lecture and use the AI to automatically transcribe what's going on with it too. Sean Angel, Fox News.